What's going on, buddy? My name is Chris, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Golden Sun! Last time we started exploring Alton Peak here. Dang it. Trying to save Alton, because it's being flooded by disgusting monsters. Ah, here we go! Lost enemies that are unique to this area. Well, not unique, but. <laughs> Last new enemies in this area. Calamar! Let's go to my menus here. I'll go over what they do, who they are, where they come from, who their mamas are. Okay, so they have thir they're level 13, they have 104 HP each. They drop 79 gold and 59 experience points. They have a 6.25% chance of dropping elixir, and they can use ally search, which does the same thing as um, slimes where they call an ally. Maybe you'll have to see that here. And they can also use an electric fight, which has the chance to paralyze. Don't get touched by his tentacles. I guess they're jellyfish monsters, is what the entire yoke is here. Let's heal Ivan, because he's always, always being hurteth. So since we killed that last living statue, the water that was once here has now receded, so you can go deep onto the mines. Ooh. Um, tarantulas. <clears throat> I think it's good. We'll do a few more battles, and I'll probably start cutting them out. Yeah! Critical attack, which 88 damage. That's not a whole lot. Ah! Poison! There we go. First time someone's been poisoned. Uh-oh. So how poison works? Whenever someone uses- whenever someone's poisoned, and they attack, they get damage dealt to them. Quickly attack. We could use Restore here. There we go. And in addition to that, outside of battle, you don't lose it when you go out of battle here. You'll see it says Garrett underneath his name, it says Poison. You'll see if Frago Nelson say anything. If you run around enough, you'll see that noise. Tell me that. Oh, maybe you should fix your crap, dude. Beautiful. I love that sound effect. Take a little peek around here. Ha! I'm gonna switch down here. I don't think there's anything extra to do here. Love this minecart because it's, it's literally just oh, so much terrain that I don't have to worry about uh, fighting monsters from. <laughs> so I have a love hate relationship with random battles. There was a path to the left that I already see we go by it anyways. There we go. Wow! Imagine doing that in real life. That would be horrifying. Do not waint. Also convenient how they just happen to like be perfect like that. Ain't it a slime beast? Hello! Hello, my Tito! Alright. Bam! Ain't a curse I, I love how the slimes always look so bored. Look, look, at, look at his face. I'm so bored. Ah, there we go. Double experience and double coins from him. And double chance from him to drop something, but of course he didn't drop anything. Ooh! Gimme, 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 gimme! Ah, oh, god damn it! Treasure is really a mimic. Oh man. Oh, who? What a scene coming. Oh, the huge Maddie. Mimic. He is level 16. Uh, you know what? Oh, we haven't used Quake Spear yet. Um, so this is 15 synergy points, which is a freaking lot, man. And uh, it, it can attack all enemies on the fields. Let's use it. Cause a giant. Wait, does it? Does this description change? Uh, goes from a powerful quake, mighty tremor, to a massive quake. <laughs> oh man. I pressed, I pressed the wrong number. Uh, we'll go with Heat Wave. Um, attacks that are based off of attacking one person are normally pretty strong. I think she's gonna read here, so let's do that, shall we? Alright, so this Mimic is level 16. He has 579 hit points. He can drop 267 gold, 241 experience points. I won't spoil what he drops. Uh, he can use Debilitate, which lowers multiple people's defense. Uh, there we go. <laughs> You can use Side Drain, which uh, takes your synergy away from you and gives it to him. Um, you can use Sleep, which is a pain. You can use Shine Plasma, wow. I say as if I didn't know that was coming, but actually I didn't. Uh, Shine Plasma is actually the upgraded version of Plasma, so perhaps we'll get to see it. Let's use Fireball, shall we? If I not. And sure, we'll use Jupiter, just, just because I feel like it. Brrr. And it's not dead. And oh. I know. I get the feeling he's gonna shine plasma. I know he's gonna do it. Oh, he is! Dang it! That's okay. We'll have plenty of time to see that later on. Wow, he's still alive. What you look at that? Um, is there anything we haven't seen yet from here? We've seen oil drops, I believe, causes damage to flames. Uh, we could just attack normally, shall we? Isaac has a pretty good attack. What about you? Do you have anything? Um, Bramble Seed. We have not seen this yet, so we use that. 
And you don't have anything that's never been used before. Alright, so you storm, eh? What about you, Mia? Nothing. <laughs> Alrighty then. Oh, dang, there's actually something new I was gonna do. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> I just know, level 59, maximum HP by 7. Maximum HP by 3. Attack by 3, defense by 1, agility by 4. You got 267 coins and a game ticket. A lot of these guys are kind of lame. <laughs> they don't give you anything good. Um, okay, so I don't know why I did that for, but I did it. But I did it, Carl Steinzer. Uh, we can go up that ladder there, but don't be so hasty, my friends. You don't want to use frost on this. Maybe we should get rid of that frost gem jewel. Oh gosh, dangers. Um, let's take the opportunity. Actually, let's do this. We'll do that. I just. I haven't shown Cure Poison yet, and I don't know if we'll ever really get the chance to really use this uh, inside a battle since it's kind of a waste of a turn. Restore and Cure Poison have the same animation, so let's use it. Just show what it looks like. Hopefully, it'll actually show. Oh, okay, good. That's what that looks like. No, okay. <laughs> I was gonna say, you know, I never considered that. I might actually get damaged in battle with poison, and I'll have to actually use it, but. Nah, it's all good, my sucker. Alright, <laughs> Jump this random ice cube in the middle of the room that is not melting next to fire, thankfully. Oh, uh, you hear that? You hear that, Grandma? <gasps> I said another mimic. I don't think so. Burgess. All right, after this battle, I'm gonna start cutting these out. At least in situations where I could, where I'm not in the middle of saying something. <laughs> Maybe that's how I should do this. 25 episodes in, and I still don't know how to cut these battles out. Really? You suck. Yay! Who's started, Jim? There's frost here, and I think there's another frost situation to the top left there, if I recall correctly. I I R C. Is it over here? It might be more on the left. Oh, don't tell you I went the wrong way. Oh, no, I'm just waiting for the battle. Okay. Oh wow, there is nothing here. God damn it. Well then, I thought there was another frost spot, but apparently there's not, and I'm just an idiot. You are an idiot. So if you just jump with this mine cart right away. I think this will do what I want it to. Eh, yes! It was actually going the wrong way, but kind of the right way, because it leads to this chest. Which contains a dragon shield. Ooh, resists fire. Uh, especially useful to Isaac, since, you know, he's Earth, so fire burns Earth, so you'd imagine it'd be much more useful to him than Garrett. And this would seem to have the same plus defense. There we go. Jump back in here. <sighs> There's a switch right there. I just want to hit it, but I can't. Uh, that's okay. Every little thing is gonna be all right. But we saw where it is now, so that's good. And oops, I can't not talk in this battle apparently. Let's let's do some 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 little something some, shall we? Yes, yeah, freaking just rock these guys all as strong as synergy. Let's show how powerful you truly become. Nisla hasn't learned anything good. Being a healer, I mean, she doesn't learn. A whole lot of attack spells. I'll eat like right away. Good. Wow, it's two on two hits. Gears now level 15. Maximum HP goes up by 8. PB by 3. Attack by 3. Defense by 2. Agility by 4. Good, Garrett. Yes, my friend. Grow. That voice really hurt my throat. <laughs> A lot. No, no. I don't know why it's so hard. When you like walk into things like this, you normally walk around it and it's really difficult. Oh no! Someone just leveled up by. I think it was Ivan. HP is up by 7, PP by 3, attack by 3, defense by 2. God damn, I don't think there's a way to tell. Agility by 4. Oh, it is Ivan because his HP went up to 116. I think so. I was looking at HP. I didn't think HP went up when he leveled up. I thought he still had to heal, but. Alright. If I go up, I mean. Wait. Wait. No, Ivy did that! I was so. Oh god. If you got attacked in the same spot again, I'd be so sad. Uh, I, w I went the wrong way again! Alright. Oh no. Get out there, you! Bam. And if I didn't just have a brain aneurysm. Okay, good. That does take me the right way. Say, <laughs> Hopefully, I did actually hit that switch. I'm not crazy. <laughs> Wait, I'm crazy, anyways. Banana. Uh, do we need to heal? Nah, we should be okay. Living statue up here! Oh, I should actually summon Rush. 
one of these guys. Just to show you, like, how crazy, like... Like, it's just too OP. And this really kills pretty much everything. You know, like, most bosses in my practice file? I wasn't even doing this in my practice file, because it's too cheap. Uh, but even my pra like, I tried doing that in my practice file, and yeah, I'm, like, killing most bosses in, like, two or three turns. It's like, wow, it's, it's sad. <laughs> So for some reason, the mimic in this cave, I have a very like specific memory of uh, Isaac leveling up when you defeat that mimic, and he got Ragnarok, and that was my first playthrough. I don't know why I specifically remember that. Yeah, sure, why not? Um, but I do, and that's just one of those like random things. Like, why is that? Why is why does my brain think that's a necessary memory? This feels like golden some memories. I remember one time I played it. This is probably my first time playing the game. I was gonna clean the forest. I just left it. I don't know if I've beaten it or not. And um, I left my Game Boy on all night long. I was just sitting on the, uh, I was sitting on the chair in the living room. I remember my dad? He fell asleep on the couch at night. I mean, like, I remember like seeing, like, going to play my Game Boy in the morning, leaving it on the couch like an idiot because you know someone could easily sat on broke it. Although those things are pretty freaking hard to break. I was a pretty angry child. I'd always punch and throw it across the room, and it like it didn't even show any signs of wearing care at all. But uh, I remember like the music was playing, and my dad was like, "Oh, I thought I heard something last night." This is a very distinct memory. And there we go. Cool. We did it. We did it. We did it. We did it. Hooray! Sorry, I just editing my notes like a bad born boy. Um. Is there anything back there? I think there is. Eh. Jump in the minecart! It's also interesting, whenever you fight one of those guys as well, all the things, like the frost pillars, like that's back to water. Don't know why that is. I mean, we didn't leave the room. You know, like, only stuff like that resets after you leave the room. It's like, you don't get any random encounters other than then the stuff resets. That was like a random encounter any different than a boss, like a mid-boss encounter. I don't know. Betty Vid, Betty Vid. Definitely could have made it so I didn't talk in this battle. Wait, oops, I don't have that concentration, you see. What is that? Good, I didn't see enough of that. The more leashes we see, the better. In fact, we're going for all damn unleashes. It's all about the unleashes, about the unleashes. Dan, dan, eh. Oh, there is more here, right? Okay! And I'm back! I'm back! Uh, wait, was there water in here last time? I think there was. Is there a way down? This is actually- oh, I don't think there is, is there? No, there's no ladder there. Person is foiled again. I think we're actually okay then to, uh, retreat. The entire reason why I was running back is I remember this little area here with water in it, but no, there's no way down into that. There's nothing there, so... There you go, two water beasts defeated. We can now go down even farther. And we've actually beaten essentially like this entire town uh what do my notes for here say beep, 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 beep. right don't be too harsh on those beasts what why oops sorry to punch you old lady i'm just glad to get my house back isaac look in the oven the pots and pens are rusted oh no i'm trying to find your way west through the mountains she passes at least west at the bottom of the mine I don't know what you did, but we are grateful you defeated these. No problem, bro. Oh my god. I need to stop punching old people. It's an issue I have. Uh, I thought the village was done for. I'm glad we didn't give up hope. Cool. Um, you can see the shield shop is open. Water beasts looked exactly like Alton's guardian statues. Could the guardian statue have turned to monsters? Huh, interesting. Come to think of it, it looked like a guardian statue was spewing water. Yeah, I mean it was. Well, were you not aware, dude? I mean that, that one guard, that one statue was in like plain sight. There's something in here. Barrel and weapon shop. Is it this one? Oh wait, no, we're in the shield shop. Never mind. Ha ha. I always associate this guy with weapon shop for some reason. I don't know why. It's a good thing I could sell my armor out of the shop again. <coughs> is it not all rusted? Sorry, I coughed. We dried off all the armor and polished it up. Should be no chase rush now. Oh good, so it's gonna be weakened. Alright. Oh, just a child chest. <laughs> Girl, I want that. Uh, actually, let's take a look at the sword shop first. Don't know why I even bothered to do that. Is there anyone else up here? Do we go in this house? Yeah, it's the old couple house, right? Yeah. Where's that? There's a fire. Where's the? Ch There's no chimney. 
They're just smoking themselves out. They're killing themselves. I'm old! I don't want to do this anymore! Dies. And nine coins. Pfft. Pathetic, I know. Thank goodness, I could, the waters we see, I could open up shop again! And the merchant does enjoy being, op doing op being able to do business again. There we go. Come in! Take a look at the fine weapons! Uh, let's sell something here. I would sell bronze shield. Good. We really need to sell one thing, really. Uh, is there anything Garrett can sell? No, but we never got to use those bramble seeds, did we? Those rambling, brambling seeds. Nothing Mia could sell. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Is there any artifacts? There is! A synergy rod. It's tough. Unleash a synergy leech. Uh, so that's our top priority. This would be very good for Ivan. So we'll cook it to him. Ah, yeah. And a game ticket. My favorites. 30 is the maximum of an item you could hold, by the way. And we have 23 tickets. Ooh, Claymore! Uh, Battle Mace? Oh, she already had that. <laughs> uh, Garrett's could go by one if we got that. Elven Rapier. Ooh, go by three if we could the Elven Rapier to him. Oh, wow. 15 and. Pfft, more than 15. <laughs> there we go. Looks like there's only one person. Let's say no for a second. Just because I want to see if that would be good for Isaac. Um, I always have the habit of just selling stuff, but I really shouldn't do that because... Oh no, it's no good for Isaac. Okay, then it's garbage. Get out of my hands, it's garbage! Well, rip Arctically, you're fun for a while. What rare safe? And we're actually going to have enough to buy the uh, Claymore. It's a bit of a debate. It's like when you buy like a normal weapon like this, you do lose the ability of having um, a special, like a unleash. But I think if it's enough, like 15 in damage, additional damage is a lot compared to like you know the possibility of a, re a release, an unleash. All right, what do we got here? Uh, it's always hard to know what to buy. We could buy a chainmail. That's eh, quite a bit of armor, but we'll see if there's anything for Ivan first. Only by two, that's not worth it. How about a shield? Gauntlets? Six, that's more worth it. Ivan's defense isn't really as bad as I think it is, I guess. Eight, that's pretty good. We'll buy that. Good, good. Um, Iron Helm. That's okay. Silver Circlet. I just got some legs. I don't know why. When I do the item shop, sometimes that legs a bit. Alright. I guess we'll get this for you then, Ivan. Ivan Tom! That's free game ticket. 26 game tickets now. We're getting up, Lair. Alright. I believe that's. Does anyone need this? No. Oh! Someone can use it. Two. Oh, I didn't mean to press A there! I was saying it's not worth it. Oh, god dang. Well, rip for a coat. Oh, that sucks. Did we get the thing? Was there a thing in here? Baron of Weapon Shop. Okay, yeah, we did that. Uh, oh man, whatever. It's not a big deal, but still. And there's one more house down here. Did you feed those monsters, didn't you? No. Oh, you didn't? Still, I'm happy to be back home. So here's a kiss. Hey, you're turning beet red. That's weird. She just feels like way younger than Isaac. <laughs> He'll be thinking, you with a kiss? Oh, god dang. Hey, you're turning beet red. God dang. God dang. dang. Oh, and Pop knows something about the bar on the mine. I wish they'd tell me what it was. They do, do they? Heard someone killed the water beasts. That's why I came back. There's no place like home. These are the people that, well, one of them wanted to go told me and the other one did not. Where did the little girl come from? There was no little girl in the inn. <laughs> they had a baby and it grew up to be like seven in this time. My husband's sense for finding treasures never failed. Once the water recedes, we'll dig up the, the spot he founds. Oops. I didn't want to leave my hometown, that's why I came back. Uh-huh, I have something to do with treasure, does it? The bottom of the mine, the end of the easternmost passage. I won't give that up. Hmm, interesting. Well, I mean, we're about to enter the bo most bottom part of the mine, so that's... Maybe, yeah, we check out that house. I don't know, flushed out tons of rock from the mine. Maybe now we'll find gems and ore like we've never seen before. It'll be better than digging up one of those dar darned... Darned? Should you not say darn there? Darn ancient relics. It's weird that this town is all sad still because there is no more water. There is no more flooding. There is more to the dungeon. Like there's one more mine section here still, but weird. It's still kind of weird to me. 
Um, but I guess I'll call it an episode here. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like and subscribe to our channel if you're already. And what I mean by this, by the way, is that there, there's a little more living statue we gotta kill. But that being said, like, there's no more water here, so why is, every, why is everyone so sad? It's weird. Thanks for watching, everybody. I mean, I guess all their stuff is ruined, so that is a good reason. But, you know, as you would probably imagine, things get much more happier once I defeat the final one. So, there's really not much of a difference between then and now. For them, anyway. <sighs> Anyways, I'll talk to you guys next time. <laughs> Goodbye!